So when it comes to upscaling a low quality photo into something that looks sharper and prettier, then I do recommend to use the tools from Topaz Labs. They do have Gigapixel and also the new web version of Gigapixel called Upscale. And this tool is accessible for free. You can sign up and they'll give you 10 credits for free. But this is not the best tool that you can try because I just found another tool that is free and I gotta say the quality is even better than Topaz Labs. Now, to give you some context, uh, this is a picture that I tried to upscale using the upscale tool from Topaz Labs. I would say the quality is decent, but there are some details that are not quite right in the final picture. Now, on the left side is the original picture, and on the right side is the one that has been upscaled using Topaz Labs. Now, if you look closely, especially on the hand, it's basically not much different than the original picture, and I barely able to see the distinction between one finger with another. It is just not looking great. And also, the AI tool seems to be struggling with the facial features on the face and that is very important because most of the times you want to preserve the details of the person but unfortunately this AI model is not quite sharp enough to uh, process the facial features however there is a tool that I would say is even better in the details much better and of course it is also free to use the name of the tool is Microsoft Designer. So to use it, just navigate to designer.microsoft.com and then you can log in with your own account. Again, this tool is avail available for free and it actually gives you more credits than Topaz Labs. Now after that, click Edit with AI and then select Upscale. So for this demonstration, I'll try to use the same picture again and we are going to compare them together. I will click this device because I want to upload that from my computer and just upload and the photo will be processed immediately. Now, maybe one thing that I don't like from the upscaling feature in the designer is right now, there is no option to select the uh, final resolution, unlike in the Topaz Labs version where you can select the upscaling factor and also some other details. But in Microsoft Designer, you can only upload the picture and that's about it. There is no setting whatsoever. Perhaps for some, it is something that uh, actually appreciated because that means there is less settings to worry about. But on the other hand, it also means that they're going to apply a blanket setting for basically all pictures. But regardless, I think for uh, 4k resolution it is actually quite decent now we got uh, this result and there is actually a quick comparison that you can do you can just drag and drop uh, this slider to see before and after the result now again let's just zooming in into the hand you'll see that this time around the hand is actually quite this thing it is easy to recognize so i'll just do the sliding before after and then before after again the fingers are now separated it is a lot easier to recognize and also the facial feature looks way way better okay it's difficult to navigate around this but yeah i can tell that the face looks way way better now if you're quite happy with the result you can click accept and by the way, regardless whether you are clicking accept or decline, it still consume your credit. And speaking about credits, you will get 15 credits every single month. And if you want to get more credits, you have two options. Either you have to subscribe to the paid version of Microsoft or just use their products like Bing or Microsoft uh, 365 and they'll give you some rewards which can be redeemed into credits. Now, here I got some glitches. So we got this tiny preview on the original picture, sorry, on the uh, upscale picture, but this is a glitch. This is not something that will be embedded into the actual picture. So don't worry about that. Now after that, to download the content, just click download. And then you can select the format and after that click download so this might take quite a while because the image is actually pretty big again it is going to give you a 4k resolution so that's quite huge but the upside is the quality is going to be way way better now just wait and i'm going to show you the result instantly all right so this is the picture i'm going to open it there you go. Yep, this is the picture. It's really huge, but again, the details 
are amazing in fact i can see the hair of the person it's great now if you look closely at the one the, the one that has been created by topaz lab i cannot even see the hair but on the one from microsoft the the hair is definitely there so uh, I think this is a decent alternative, or I would say better alternative to Topaz Labs if you want to upscale your own photo. So uh, that's basically how you can use the upscaling feature from Microsoft Designer. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on my next video.